man for shooting a dog in the face. It happened over the weekend, and a warning you may find photos of the dog disturbing. Newswatch 16's Jessica Albert is live now in the newsroom with an update on that dog's condition. Jessica. John Julie, the dog is still in a vet hospital with serious injuries. The man charged with shooting the dog is facing multiple counts of animal cruelty. Over the weekend, this photo posted to the Hillside SPCA's Facebook page showing a dog shot in its face angered many people in the area. I don't know what to say. I mean, I just don't even like thinking about it, really. Pure rage. Um, I have no idea what would possess anyone to go into a home, shoot someone else's pet um, for whatever reason. Pottsville police say it was 30-year-old Anthony Holmes who shot the dog at an apartment on West Market Street in Pottsville over the weekend. The dog, a 10-year-old German Shepherd mix named Diddy, belonged to Holmes's friend. According to arrest papers, Holmes was inside the apartment and got angry when the dog began to bark at him. So he got his gun and then shot the dog. Both the dog and Holmes ran from the home after the shooting. A Hillside SPCA worker found Diddy wandering the streets and took him to the vet. And they said that um, he was very lucky to even be alive. Um, he was shot um, in the face. The bullet is still lodged in his face. Diddy's owner couldn't afford to treat the injuries and left him with the SPCA. Workers say Diddy is in very serious condition. They are unsure if he will be able to see out of his right eye. It's gruesome. Um, I just can't understand what goes on in someone's mind to just think it's okay to just shoot an animal directly in the face. Um, it's animal cruelty. That's what that is. SPCA workers are taking donations from the public to help cover Diddy's medical costs. Information on how you can donate can be found on our website, WNEP.com. Jessica Albert, Newswatch 16, live in the newsroom. All right, Jessica, thank you.